everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to my channel, hi, my name is Huey. So before I get into this review, I just wanted to say that I hope everyone out there is doing well and everyone is at peace and everyone is just, you know, uh, keeping calm during this pandemic right now. My heart and soul goes out to all of you guys. We are all affected. You know, we are in this together and I just really hope that, you know, you guys will stay strong. We will get through this pandemic and I just really, really love you all and I'm thinking about all of you as of right now. All right, you guys. So with that being said, let's get on to this review. Now, I just wanted to do a review on one of my all-time favorite perfume. This is the Creed Love in White perfume. I do have the Love in White for Summer um, by Creed, which is uh, a limited edition that was released last year. I'm not sure if they still have it, but I will link the video down below if you guys are interested. But yeah, so this is one of my favorite perfume, you guys, and I really love it. I think Michelle Obama wears this perfume, and this is just a unique perfume that I cannot really find a dupe for it anywhere. So I will read you guys the notes on uh, the um, Creed website. So the top notes are orange zest from Italy, middle notes are Florentine iris, daffodil from France, magnolia, Bulgarian rose, Tonkin rice, and the base note is vanilla, ambergris, and Mysore sandalwood. And I'm sorry if I pronounced any of those wrong, but you guys, this perfume is absolutely really amazing. I definitely smell the Tonkin rice right here. Um, it has like that nice smoky scent to it. Now, um, if you guys ever cooked rice in a rice cooker, and if you uh, um, uh, kind of open the rice cooker when as soon as it's done cooking, and if you smell that kind of like that smokiness to it, it has that essence in it. And it's just very mysterious, very vibrant, and it just smells really yummy, you guys. And it, it does start out a little bit citrusy, so that's where the orange zest come in. And then I definitely do smell the uh, the iris, definitely really smell the iris. And I do smell the Tonkin rice as well, and I do smell the vanilla, and I do smell a little bit of the sandalwood in the dry down. Now, the longevity of this perfume is so long, you guys, like six hours or more on my skin. The sillage is out there, okay? Like, when I wear this, when I go out in public, I walk past someone, they will literally stop me and ask me what I'm wearing because it's just a magical, magnificent, sophisticated, ethereal, vibrant fragrance. This is a beautiful fragrance right here. It's definitely worth the money, you guys. It's one of my favorite perfume. I do uh, love the Creed brand. Like, they just really... Um, kind of like radiate luxury and just radiate life uh, and every time I wear a Creed it just brings me you know life it just brings me happiness and it just brings me like you know beauty and grace I absolutely love it highly recommend this perfume you guys um, yeah so with that being said I know that this is a pretty fast review right here fast straight to the point but I do highly recommend Creed Love and White if you were to ever get it because when you wear it you will feel very elegant you will feel very graceful you will feel very glamorous you will feel very luxurious and uh, most of all you will feel really happy when you wear this fragrance because people are going to flock all over you and ask you what it is and compliment you from head to toe. Alright you guys, so that being said, this is my review on Creed Love and White. I hope you guys like it. If you guys do, please give me a thumbs up and also subscribe for more videos and also send this video to anyone who is interested in buying Creed Love and White. With that being said, take care. I love you all and be safe out there. Bye!